Hello and welcome back to Lost Constellation. I'm guessing that right now we're going to go find out the Hutcher, whatever it was. We're going to see if we can find that person thing, false god. This is a roller coaster up here. It's just all of a sudden you get a roll. Is that a knife? It. <laughs> Who's that walking on my porch? It's me, the Empress Altair or whatever. Oh, girl, it's all over now. <laughs> it's all ogre now. Oh. Oh, snap. Ooh. Don't have my snowballs. She took my snowballs away. I'm defenseless. Oh. Hello there. There are old bo bones in the north. Where the ground never thaws. Frozen in the dirt and ice for millennia. In some of them there is a sickness against which we are no longer strong. Someday the earth will warm and the ice will melt. And that sickness will finish the work on us. That began when we were first born. Uh, is that a poem? Kid, will you please stop that honking? Nope. Fine, kid, fine. I'm gonna leave you where they'll never find you. Ha ha ha. Let's see here. I'm sorry, am I interrupt for something important? I think you know the answer. You just show up. We all just show up. Staying is the problem. But you won't have to worry about that. Will you? Is that extremely... Um, I'm gonna do this. When you're out there tonight freezing, will you look for my ring? Once something's down in the brim, because I can never see it. I during last week. Oh, so you did. It's my second most prized possession. I keep the most prized in a shrine, so precious it is to me. It's so painful, we have to keep the precious and painful close. I feel like we keep getting off track here. Yep. Sniff, sniff. I can smell the forest gods blessing on you. If you knew the thing, you'd, you'd wash until it came off of your skin. When you leave, you're going down into the brambles like all the others. Then I have to go down outside to fix the weather. Because the weather vane got knocked around again. It's a really stupid system you have going there. When uh, that's, That voice sounds familiar. <laughs> Just the way whenever she talks that... Meh. I think it's the um the little midget things from Zelda, Wind Waker. Mini blends that's what they're called, isn't it? That's what it sounds like when I got out. I look on the hollow and nothing will be stirring. And that will be what happened to you. Why don't you just kill me now then? Because of that smell. I smell you mean. I'm guessing it's the, the hunter. What are you in I'm a crocodile. Astronomer, former apprentice. Oh, honey, all of those stars in your head. They will go out like candles tonight. Oh, man. What are you? The forest god isn't really a god. I am twice their size. I am twice as real. Honestly, whoever you are, even you're twice as real as they are. Adina, Adina, Astra. A ridiculous name. You named yourself, I can tell. Just in the last, just the last part. Now, what would make a little girl change her last name? Nothing you'd understand. You don't know a thing about it. I came from somewhere. As did the woman before me. And we found the cabin, and I fed the oven. And her survived, and then I survived. And the quarrel with the forest god went on for centuries. Until it ended quite recently. Well. Shut it, kid. I swear if it wasn't physically present in her shit. Her. If I wasn't physically present in here, she'd talk about anything. Ooh. This game is very story heavy. Dialogue heavy. Are you a witch? What is a witch? You mean the woman in the woods? The man in the woods is a hermit or a woodsman or a huntsmith. They didn't have a name for women who weren't there where they should be. So they stole a name they feared and hated. And pressed it onto us. Onto you. The word they use for girls like me is kidnapped. 
this one every day, I swear. I want to do chores. Back sass, sass mouth. Why not send her back for where she came? That's the one question to which I have no answer. Let's just keep talking, I guess. We're done. Okay, never mind. I'm sorry, Dina Astro. I know you wanted to live, but I've taken that future from you. And it's mine now. And you can't take it back. Ooh. Well. Yeah, this seems oddly familiar. Over here. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Lost Constellation. Wait a second. This seems familiar. I've already done this. Okay. So, can I not pass the porch now? Am I walking slower? I guess so. Let's see what's this way. Is that water? It sounded like water, but I guess it's not. It's just snow. It's frozen water! The best kind of water. Oh, we got some lucky here. Some of that weird snow is way up in the trees. Need a good strong wind. Ah, I just need to control the wind. It's all simple. Hey Link, get that wind waker. I gotta do something. You don't see the snow, so... Okay. They were, they were talking about... Uh, the person was talking about... Something about the wind, the weather. She had a weather controlling device. Top of the house, maybe. Maybe it was the thing I was trying to hit earlier. Let's see here. Yeah, that way up there. I'm gonna have to come over here and then turn up on and then shabam. I swear I just want to walk slower on this porch. There we go. Oh. Oh. Down you go. <laughs> okay. Ugh. I'm not going to die here tonight. I'm just not. I need to see what's in this hollow. I need to get into that house. Okay, let's go. got her own theme tune. I'm guessing that's the Huncher. That's what they were calling it, right? She already fixed her little thing. We go forth. Don't know where we're gonna get the other snowball. Oh, look, there it is. Never mind. Some of that weird stuff. Okay. Put this up here. Need something special for this. Oh god, I have to get back in that house. <laughs> yep. Sure is. It's the first one I ever had. I guess. Unless it really is just the winter solstice and there's nothing actually special about the night. It's just what they call the winter solstice. Solacistus Salami. The winter salami. Let's see, can I get back in the house? No. Okay. I don't have any snowballs. <laughs> Herp or derp. I get like low frame rate over here. Getting 13, 14, 13. 10 snowballs. Is that actually 10? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yep. Um.
So I've got to do something. I'm so cold, so cold. No, I'm an astronomer. Those are my skies, dang it. I'm gonna survive this. Yeah, America. There's only one philosophy I follow, and that is the mighty American dollar. Maybe I have to hit it and then hide under the porch. Oh, the wind's... Sound? Hello, sound? Guess you don't exist anymore. Oh, no, they are. Oh. Wait. Got it, got it. Oh, oh, so close. There we go. I need somewhere to hide. Under the porch, of course. Except that you're freezing in the brambles tonight. Oh. Okay, maybe not. Maybe I have to hide in the brambles. The brambles. She seems to be by the weather thing. Maybe. Hmm. The weather thing. Hmm. Uh. Not entirely sure what I need to be doing. Twice, maybe? Do the brambles! Oh, okay. <laughs> Run! <laughs> nope. <laughs> Get away! I guess I was right and then I need to hide in the brambles. Since you know Adina said it. I like the character design in this game. It's very... It's complex and yet simple at the same time. It's like freedom in a cup. Here we go. Hide the brambles! Squirrels! Don't win black brain, wolf in the dark. YOLO! Oh, no, 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 no. Hello there. I can get you out of here. You cannot even get out of yourself out of here. I can barely get out of the attic. And away from that extremely creepy shrine. It's not safe for you here. Did you know that I made that poison that you never even thanked me? Get away! No poison. Well, now I got it or something. I noticed that she's hun hunchback, so that's probably why they call her the Huncher. Mr. Obvious. Time to make snowmen! I know I made the right choice whenever I decided to make the thumbnail snowman. Yeah! Give me some depth to this. Be a sad face. Aww. Aww. Look at him. It's probably gonna be a her. But whatever. What? No, no. Cough, cough, cough. No! Oh. That's morbid. Oh. Hello, Hunter. What is this? Oh, oh god, no. Girl, what have you done? You, you watched it happen. You watched! 
It wasn't me. It was this place. I. It was the oven. It was what you became. What? They can choose what happened to me. I was so. Oh, oh! <laughs> I thought that was a Dina talking. I was like, "What are you talking about?" <laughs> Oops! I was so cold. I was so afraid. I had to survive, and I did not. What's this? Who are you? Don't you dare speak, you waste of a girl. I was her twin. We fled into the woods, identical in all things, except one. She was a hobo. When she pulled my body from the water, the only part of me she kept was the tattoo. I've kept it close to me all down the centuries. I believed in some idea of you. That That is a lo as long dead as I am now. But you survived. I, I, oh my god, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry for this. Get out. I'm sorry, I never meant to hurt you. Get out. Never meant to make you cry. Da da da. Yes, my. What is the story about? What do you want it to be about? Guns! I figured she was about it. not about anything. Huh, that's quite a statement. I'm really smart. Well, he came up with that plan to rob banks, so clearly you're onto something. I want to know what this is about. I think you have to figure that out on your own. I don't like that. I think that's gonna be it for this time. 16 minutes, yeah! I got my watch! I did a perfect... Anyway, I guess we'll- Whoa, what was- Whoa, whoa, whoa! What? What was that? Excuse me? What was that? Next, next episode over here, what the hell that was? <laughs> whoa. I need to look back on that and see what that was. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time on part four. Have a good day. See yes.